Good morning, good morning, beautiful souls. How are you? Whoa, we got things popping out already. Kelly from Mystical Madness Healing. I am going to do a reading just to check the energy for today. November, hmm, I don't even know. November 8th, 2022. Let's see. Uh, I'm going to do something a little different. Uh, our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us these trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Believe us. Oh, lead us not. I, I went off on a tangent in my mind. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Just felt like that prayer was needed today. Let's see what that one wants to come out here. What do we got? Oh, yes. Ace of Cups right off the bat. Love it. Maybe that prayer helped. <laughs> this one. Okay. But somebody is um, worrying about this. They are in a Five of Cups, which is uh, like a defeatist energy. So maybe they're afraid to come in with this offer. Now, this card didn't pop out. I just pulled it out. So this may not be significant here. But I just feel like uh, maybe it is just like a message like... Uh, that your your dreams are coming true, but you're you're not allowing them. Um, you're worrying about past events too much or the lack thereof. All right, so it, I'm I'm just saying, guys, in case that card didn't mean to come out, it it, it did it did even if it was just a message. Let it fly if it doesn't apply. You got the Ace of Cups coming out right away. That's a brand new beginning. Cups are love. This is from the divine for sure. Uh, okay, was it guided to uh, go to the bottom of the deck and not shuffle? Someone wants to give you equal give and take. This is a uh, love. Maybe, uh, maybe you weren't getting uh, love, money, whatever, um, you know, pentacles are like equal give and take on the money aspect but it could also be love with this with the six that's a relationship card that's why i say that um sixes in astrology um are dealing in relationships commitments um, affairs of the heart stuff like that okay so now we got the Two of Pentacles, which is a balance card. So maybe this needed uh, some balancing, obviously, with the Six of Pentacles coming out, the equal give and take card. No, we got a Two of Cups here. Sometimes the, this is uh, more of a decision, not like, um, but it's a soulmate card. It, it, it's definitely a soulmate card, but this could also be a decision. Falling under the Ace of Cups, I'm guessing that this is a soulmate. And that's why there was divine, uh, it could have even be a divine counterpart. And that's why there, you know, was a divine intervention with that Ace of Cups. Yep, yep, this was meant to come out this way. Because that Five of Cups, I said I wasn't sure. And, the, and they look the same too, these cards. With the, the brown and the, there was a tower moment here. That's why you're probably in this five of cups uh, lack energy. There was a tower moment in the past. Maybe it happened. You weren't sure what happened. You're confused. Or this could be, the tower moment could be this ace of cups, this new beginning. Tower doesn't always have to be a bad thing. Okay, it just needs to explode before it can be rebuilt
All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to shuffle now. Spirit, please clarify this tower card. Is this two of cups happening today or in the energy today? Uh, I asked that question. This is a knight of cups. This is an offer of love coming in under this equal give and take card so you got definitely got a here's your offer for the ace of cups knight of cups is um one of the i see maybe a pisces here with the fish but um lily pads could be significant the color red and gold but this is a, a very uh, genuine offer here. This this is the Knight of Cups is a little bit slower moving. Or is that the Knight of Pentacles? Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. I was going to say this could have been a little bit slower moving. But uh, this tower, this tower, I was going to say needed to come down so that there, there can be equal give and take now because it's falling on the equal give and take card so maybe the, where there wasn't uh, and I'm not just saying with money this could have been love this could have been someone holding back love and you know from you and yeah that's that's what I'm getting okay now with that two of pentacles we got someone who's a star you're either uh this is either your person or this could be an Aquarius. But the star card is is amazing to get. I mean, you started out with the Ace of Cups and you ended with the star. This could just be, I was going to say, this could just be for one person, but there's too much. No, there, uh, because of this. This is why I'm, if this wasn't here, I would say maybe this was just something from Spirit. And, and I'm... Still going to go with that, but nope. As I say that, here's the emperor. <laughs> here's the emperor. Someone coming in for you. You guys are going on a journey or together here. After a tower moment, maybe travel. Wow, I was, this is crazy. Justice, there you go. Justice is equal, and it's falling on this equal give and take card. You're getting your justice, or so justice is going to be brought to this Ace of Cups so that you guys can have this new beginning. Because not only are you either dealing with the star magician, you made this happen. You you made that. You, that's usually what the magician usually is. Somebody pulled out all. All their power. I'm not saying it's magic, but you had you had to have used all your skills and and everything you have to manifest. That's the word I want to say. A lot of people I never really knew what the word manifest was. Is the way I think about it is what you think about you bring about, and that is a true thing. So if you're thinking. I want somebody good to come in. I want I want this to happen. I feel like you manifested this new beginning. Um, obviously, there was this was a past person with if somebody wanted to give now wants to give you equal give and take. <laughs> okay, I can't talk today. My voice is gone, so everything's a strain to get out. Uh, but this. Oh my God, I just wanted to say this Taurus, you made this happen, but that's because I think I just did a Taurus reading. Here you go. Ace of Swords coming out after speaking that you manifested this in. Maybe both of you did. There's your clarity. Oh my God, Ten of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles. Not only is there a lot of love here, Ten of Pentacles is like, 
the whole package. Who is calling me? Ten of, Ten of Pentacles is like the whole package here. Oh my God, more clarity with the sun card coming out. Okay, uh, you have a lot of different options here that you could choose from. And um, maybe, I don't know, I wasn't going to keep going, but maybe you walked away from another relationship. Or you're, you were just walking away from that, not getting enough love or whatever. Because I see Hermit. And here's your empress. Uh, empress. <laughs> here's the empress. So we have an emperor and an empress. King of Pentacles coming in. So the Knight of Cups offer may be coming in as a knight, but this is a King of Pentacles. This is an empress or an emperor or an, 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 or an empress. I'm getting strong Virgo now in Taurus because of the money, the pentacles. Um, you broke free of the burdens with the seven of uh, seven of ones. People could have been, you know, uh, going against this this union in the past. Uh, as I said, that a Queen of Wands came out, so I'm not sure what that's about. And maybe that uh, Queen of Wands was putting too many burdens on you in the past. And that's why you had to be the Queen of Swords here. But you're moving away from that. This is moving away, going on a journey. We got a Hierophant here. That's probably... So we have the magician and, and a hierophant in the same reading. I'm not sure why I kept going, but I wanted to give you a little story. Okay. Okay. Someone was in this Knight of Wands energy that's kind of player. They could have been a player. That could be where the options or maybe you thought they were a player. And that's why you were looking out on the world, you know, looking out. At, you got the world in your hands here, though, with the two of wands. That's uh, hard work. There could have been toxic uh, addictions or devil energy in the past that could have delayed this, too. Yeah. I knew this Seven of Swords was somewhere. There, there was some kind of betrayal of our uh, deception or whatever. And that's why that tower needed to come down. But now, yep, after heartbreak. Wait, I said Two of Wands for something else. And now I'm getting the Two of Wands. Oh, okay, never mind. Two of Swords, you you had a you have a decision to make here on this <laughs> complete complete happiness. You have an Emperor and an Empress, Ace of Cups, Soulmate Union, divinely guided. You're gonna have four one celebration. Oh my God! And then the Ten of Cups. I'm glad I kept going. If you didn't know the, you know, if this was your reading, maybe this, maybe this, the rest of this needed to come out for clarification. Someone stuck, or were, or they were stuck in the past. That could have been with that. Um, after this heartbreak, for a long time, someone was stuck here. Um, Ah. Okay. All right. One more. Spirit. Whoa. 
uh, three of pentacles, you got help coming in. So if you, you were having a tough time, uh, needed, th this could be help from the universe with the three of pentacles or, um, help collaboration from your person. Maybe you'll be working together. Maybe your help is coming in at the right time at the, in the nick of time. So you started with the ace of cups and you ended we're ending with this collaboration card. Hope this helps, guys. Have a beautiful day.